Okay, so my test is done, and I'm going to go ahead and take this all apart again because I'm going to make these wires a little bit smaller. Okay. So this black, I'm just going to remember this left one is the black. So the red, which is the power on this switch here too, is going to go to the black. And my red and white one is going to the red. Okay. And just for ducks, I'm going to I'm going to take this whole thing off. Because I really got to make sure now that I can fit my all these wires back in there. And I see some wires in here. Let's let's get you. You see that? And the thing is, these these wires are in my way. These two wires. I can't push the box back in there all the way. And see. I might, I don't think I can push this over. I think I have to push it back and to the left a little bit. And they look pretty stiff, but I've got to really bear down on it. I really don't want to get my, um, my pliers out. I could grab it with my pliers and push on it. Um, what else do I have? Let's see if I if I grab this with my with my pliers and grab it, I could have a tendency to get right in there and score the uh, scar up the side of the wire itself. I can take a screwdriver, let's say, and see if I can't push that back in there a little bit. Yeah, see the oh, joy. See, I may have to I may have to pull this one out to rearrange the wire, dabity nabbit. Boy. I think you're getting your money's worth on this one. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to loosen this one up. And I know that's on the same breaker. That was the ceiling fan. So I'm just gonna loosen this. I just I know I just don't have enough room with that wire in the way. It's a double, it's a double wire. And I, I should have enough room if I take this one out to get it out of the way because it's, it's not as thick in the back. Okay. See that's the that's that's both of the wires right there. Look at that. See that? That's those two wires right right there in the ground wire. So look at that. I'm gonna redo. I'm gonna redo this. I think the, the wires just need to be rerouted. A little bit different to get them out of the way. Okay, so how they wrapped it around here makes it stiffer to fit in. But see, with the thinner switches, they could do that. They just pushed it right on in there. Well, I got to get that whole cavity um, empty so that I can have enough room. Okay.
See, at that time I can just use my, my little screwdriver as a pry bar. Okay, I'm going to rewire. Well, I'm just going to relocate the wires is what I'm going to do. And I'll, and I'll straighten them out in case of... I want to make sure I don't get anything messed up. Okay. okay, so for these for these wires, they're coming in through the back. And we know how to get those off, don't we? With the little with the little screwdriver. I think you can see that. Push it in, pull it out. Push it in, pull it out. Look at that. Okay. Now, do these both have to go in the same way? Um, no, I could flip flop these or whatever, but I'm going to, just for the sake of argument, I'm going to keep them the same. This one goes to the bottom. Okay. This one goes to the top. Like that. And they didn't use these side screws. So for a little bit of extra room, I'm just going to tighten these up just to get them out of the way. Now sometimes when you take these out of the back, they'll get loose for next time. You see, here's the hole. Here's the little slot underneath that I put the screw driver in. Okay, so when you put your wires back in, make sure you don't miss the hole and try to stick it in down here. I've, I've seen somebody do that before, and it really didn't work. 